Today, I would like to teach you how to find the missing factor if you know the graph and you know one of the factors. Okay, so what this problem tells us is that it, it is a third degree polynomial graph, so I know that this polynomial is degree three. And I'm given this factor, and I notice that this factor has a degree of two. In other words, if I'm dealing with a third degree polynomial, but I have one of the factors and it's a second degree, that means I'm missing a one degree polynomial, first degree. And a first degree polynomial has the following form of x plus or minus some value. You, rep you probably rec recognize this as a simple binomial. So what you're gonna do is now you're going to locate uh, the uh, location. You're gonna locate the location, right? You're gonna find the location where the graph intersects that x-axis. Now notice that it only intersects the x-axis at this one uh, place. And that's because if you look at this factor, this factor has imaginary roots to it. There's no numbers that are gonna to multiply to four, positive four, and add them to negative two, uh, positive two, that's a positive, right? Oh boy, today's gonna to be a long day. Anyway, so therefore, this graph should only now intersect the x-axis at, at one location, and therefore, this location of intersection will tell me now the value of my missing factor. So you notice that this is x is equal to one. So you can write that out, x is equal to one. But this is not in factored form, this is the root. What you have to do is you have to subtract one from both sides so that you set this baby equal to zero. And then you might begin to notice now, oh, there's the factor, right? So basically the missing factor is going to be x minus one. Simply put, you can find that location where it crosses the x-axis, just simply change the sign, plug it on in. Thanks so very much for tuning in. Check out our channel. We've got thousands of problems out there. Mathematics and physics and chemistry and more to come. Take care.